If you use Python, then you're probably familiar with using pip to install packages. But as of recently, there's a new package installer and resolver available called uvpip, which is said to be 10 to 100 times faster than regular pip. So how does that work? Well, first we'll have to understand a bit about how pip works. Pip is written in Python, and if we want to install packages using pip, there's a system it follows. So we want to install multiple packages with a requirements.txt file, we can use pip install r requirements.txt. To install these packages, pip needs to find package versions that are compatible with each other. And to do that, it needs to check the dependencies of each package by first finding a wheel file for a package which contains the package and associated metadata, getting the latest version where it can, then downloading it if it doesn't already have a copy, unpackaging it, and finally reading the package requirements which is part of the package metadata. And pip goes through and does this one package at a time. And it may get to a package which is incompatible with the previous package that it handled, which means it will have to go back and have another attempt at finding a compatible version. Back and forth, checking, downloading, and unpacking is reliable but slow. Enter uvpip, which is written in Rust. Rust is inherently faster than Python, but UV also has some other tricks it can take advantage of when it comes to package resolution. Take the same scenario as before, where pip has to download and unpack each wheel. UV pip is able to query the dependencies of each wheel file directly without having to download it. And on top of that, UV is able to do these operations concurrently, which makes it even faster again. If you want to use UV pip yourself, you simply need to install it, which can be done using pip. Just use pip install uv and you can start using it straight away. uv is still growing and you can keep up with the latest developments from the creator Astral from the GitHub that I'll put in the link below.